Um, so D okay. is asking, when will you do a stream on Tigre? Human rights groups have been reporting um, recent photos show children in the same condition as Yemen. Um, to be honest, I don't yeah. know if we should do a stream on Tigre. Like, it is so complex. Um, I'm <laughs> learning about a lot of these different dynamics, especially in the ethnic federalism of Ethiopia for the first time. Um, it's a it's it's a conflict where there aren't i mean it's not this way necessarily in every any conflict but you know there's no just perfect good guy like there there's a lot of bad stuff on all sides um it but that's true with yemen as well yeah yeah but i i don't know i don't know what do you think Armin? I mean, yemen like, is very complicated and there's also no good sides and so that's also the same thing um honestly like maybe one i just don't why... know to be able to like bring it to an audience responsibly i think i know more than most people because most people know nothing <laughs> but i mean there are a simplified version of it like there are the two main groups involved and also the other country involved like we like i mean the thing is that other people have done it better than us that's why I don't know if we can like take it. This is not something that, um, I mean, we are following it, but, but it's not something that we're known for following. Uh, it's not something that we have a background in following. And that's why I don't know if it, we would be the right platform for it, but we will consider it. Um, yeah. Another thing is that it keeps changing so fast that every mm -hmm. week i think like if i do a stream on it next week this stream is going to be obsolete um yeah so yeah so i mean situations are bad in yemen poverty is like situations are bad extremely bad in certain regions in iran in afghanistan and these places our audience is more see like if we do if we do Tigray, a lot of people might be like, that's what that that's not why I'm subscribed to you. Like I'm subscribed to you guys for covering a different region. That's what makes us wonder. Because if we want to just highlight everything based on the human cost, then are we gonna start talking about climate change, you know, streams on climate change? Because that's the major human, you know. Uh, human cause, right? So we do need to, we need, we do need to make to keep our streams in line with why people are subscribed here, or else it's going to be all over the place, right? But we, you know, so, and D is saying I have been asking for a year, nobody's paying attention. Oh, okay. Um, um, D, would you be interested in coming and us maybe talking to us about it? I don't know. Maybe we could talk to you, D, about it um okay, or maybe okay I'll... during our q a's like ask a specific question and then that yeah. will give us the context to talk about it yeah mm. it's really it's so tough because it's also something that i don't think many governments are going to want to intervene on so here's 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 the reason okay here's a one reason why we don't cover it okay Whenever I see things in Af happening in Afghanistan, Iraq, Iran, Yemen, we have something to add beyond what is the coverage of what's happening. Do you know what I mean? Like we have a perspective on it um, because of being in touch with people from there, because of being from there, because of reading and studying um, a lot more, you know, the decision making behind this you know behind the scenes the a lot of more geopolitical like specifically like narrow geopolitical stuff specific to that region or more a global perspective of it we have these insights to what's happening like like if you watch like cnn or al jazeera or reuters or coverage of it beyond what's being explained over there we have something to add to that because we know something that we can add to that, not just like, oh, here's what's happening, right? But when it comes to this story, we just know we can only tell you what is happening 
and we will get yeah. that from other news coverage. And you already have that in mainstream news coverage telling you what's happening. So it's hard for us to be like, okay, well, we're just repeating what's happening. You know, I don't know. I don't have the, the, the additional insight that would make the stream valuable beyond what you're getting in other places. That's the reason why I'm not covering it. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah, that's a really good way of encapsulating it. Because, mm. I mean, I appreciate, of course, that this is a channel where we do talk often about humanitarian issues. We do talk about human rights, and this is something that we promote and care about a lot on this channel. So on one hand, you know, I sometimes feel hypocritical. It's like, well, why shouldn't we cover a specific, like, this problem or this topic or this region? Um, well, one, we can't cover everything. We do have to make choices and narrow our focus. But then it's also like what you're saying, like what value can we actually bring to when we talk about these things? And me being a, like, I, I know what's going on, um, but I'm still a baby when it comes to understanding that region, that conflict, that history. Um, so yeah, I don't, I don't know if I would have anything like valuable to add. Um, yeah. So, sorry to just another way. Another way we could cover it is just make it one segment in one of our news coverage, secular rarities, such as. Yeah. yeah it's to remind people that it's terrible and we need to do something with this conflict. I don't actually know what we can do besides, like yeah, maybe donate to we someone do. who's helping, like food supplies because of the famine but in yeah, in other could, regards like i don't think there's going to be like intervention at this point in time yeah atheist republic needs your help we have been the target of many legal attacks by hindu nationalists ever since our founder armin Abhabi blasphemed against hindu deities we have retained legal counsel to help us defend our access to our community in india we have started a fundraiser that will help us afford to tackle many legal issues, including judicial harassment and censorship. Whatever you can contribute will go a long ways in helping us in this fight. Link in the description below.